one of the craziest endings ever. We completed our challenge wheel and I pulled 89 overall Will Johnson. That is the greatest pull I've ever gotten in this entire game and he was unusable for us, which is nuts. But the good news is we got a win and our record is sitting at two and one. Not only that, but that very same pack also had Utah's edge rusher, Connor O'Toole. Six foot four, 80 speed, 83 excel. So a nice addition to our defensive line. And I got to move Ruben Bain Jr. to D-tackle one. So now the only holes on defense are Tanner Ferris, Breston, Towery, and Angelo Gross. And Oladipo, yeah, it could be a little better. Also, I thought he played for the Pacers but I don't even think he's on the Pacers. Offensively, we're very top-heavy. It's pretty much the Mariota, Ali Gordon show. And the big thing I want to show up is my tight end, Gervais Johnson. I use tight ends way too much to be throwing to Gervais Johnson. So hopefully we can get a stud tight end today and push our record to three and one or three wins away from the playoffs and two losses from being booted. And hey, hopefully my pack luck stays up just in a different fashion, you know? Let's get it, baby! The wheel of cut, our first wheel spin of Today's episode will land us. It's gonna be a stories of the week player. I don't think there's a tight end in this promo. There's Frenchie and Yul Keith Brown. I'm very familiar with them. The 83s are Bo Frailer. Dylan Carnell, hybrid Mizzou. Ooh, a big right tackle? I'm tempted to go right tackle. I think I am. Yeah, this is our choice right here. We're taking Jeremy James out of Ole Miss. 6'5", 83 strength. Gotta keep working on that offensive line. We already run the ball so much. So a stud addition like Jeremy James, that's huge. We have a 77 right tackle right now. So that's plus six there. But also my right guard is a 68. So we're gonna move that 77 right tackle here where he's a 72. So we actually get plus six on right tackle and plus four on right guard. Looking a lot better. We really just need guards now. That leads us to our second wheel spin where I'm still trying to get a tight end. Hopefully we can get some big, oh my God, we get jackpot. Oh, oh. Dude, I'm thinking about jackpot though, but who? What tight end options are there? Now, technically with Jackpot, I could get any single player in this game. And it is so hard, so hard to look at Luther Burden and not just pick him up instantly. Luther Burden is nuts. 88 speed, 86 jump, 5'11". But I'm gonna be honest, I don't really use my wide receivers that much. I mean, last game, my leading receiver was Ollie Gordon. Travis Hunter picked up a big one. So did Isaiah Nayor, but oh, I want this card so bad. I just don't think it's the right choice. I really think I take a jackpot tight end. The 88 to 89s in this game right now, there's a couple outside linebackers in a center. I really don't think we go this route either. Quinshawn Judkins is an absolute dog, but Ollie Gordon is already getting the job done super well. Okay, so the highest overall tight end of the game, Oklahoma Sooners, Mark Andrews. And if I didn't go with him, I would just have my pick of the litter on the core elites or Jason Morrow. Colson Loveland is a dog, dude. I, we have to go Marky Mark, right? In case you missed it, Mark Andrews, Oklahoma Sooner. 6'5", 83 speed, and 86 in almost every other stat. His blockings aren't bad, and he's 250 pounds. We gotta go, Mark Andrews, man. <laughs> hey, I asked for a stud tight end, and that's exactly what I'm getting, a stud tight end. 86 overall, Mark Andrews is our starting tight end. Oh, let's go. Honestly, feels so good to see him on this offensive lineup. We're a 78 overall now. And we've got some serious threats. Ollie Gordon, Travis Hunter, Mark Andrews. He's added to our top five now as well. And don't forget, gentlemen, we still got one more spin. Getting jackpot this early is crazy. I'm so happy to have it. We just got to win the game. Now we get two 80s and it's our position of choice. I got to take at least one outside linebacker, I think, because Tanner Ferris is just so dated right now. I'm just going to be honest. Jason Henderson is kind of a shit linebacker. <laughs> like, honestly, he is. He's 74 speed. is so slow. But this is my Old Dominion legend. Jason Henderson was my guy at Old Dominion. And that rebuild took me 18 hours. In honor of that rebuild, Jason Henderson is my first buy here. That's what it's all about, right? It's ultimate team. And I'm also going to pick up a right guard, Taron Tayo from Ball State. I'm picking him up solely because when the hell else are we going to get a player from Ball State? Let's be real, gentlemen. They are actually the worst team in the game. Next season's team wheel, I'm going to land on Ball State just for saying that shit. I know it. And as slow as Jason Henderson is, he is still a huge improvement on Tanner Ferris. All right, gentlemen, here's our revamp lineup going into today's game. Jason Henderson on defense, Taron Tayo, Mark Andrews, and Jason. Jeremy James on offense. Now to keep Mark Andrews, we gotta win this game. So this is a big one. And of course the challenge wheel. Remember if I complete this and lose, I could salvage a player. And I really need to salvage a player if I lost. Over under 55 plus. Okay, 
Here's how this challenge works. I get to decide whether it's over or under. And life's just too short to bet the under. I'm saying over 55 plus, that's for the full game. So if I score 30 points and my opponent scores 26, that's the over. That's 56 total points. Ironically, last game, you know what the score was? It was 30 to 25. It landed right on 55. And in that scenario, I lose the challenge. We have to go over 55 total points scored in this game. Oh shit, he's got 89 Abdul Carter. I could have picked him up on my jackpot. So if he gives me hell, then we're gonna find out. Cincinnati versus Oregon. He's got an 81 overall. We've got a 79. Should be an awesome matchup. Got home field, baby. I love having home field. I think at this point, the game has finally figured out like my ELO. But I have to remember this shit. Just gotta make him juke. That's interceptable. Oh, almost. All right, I'm a Shamar James here. He's got to sit down in the middle. He doesn't take it. Hits his tight end. Maybe a run play here. Third and four. No. Uh-oh, I did just vacate the deep middle, but that's fine. Damn, that is a huge... Is that a tight end or is that an offensive tackle? Dude's made two catches already. Got to always be ready for the run. This also could be RPO here. Uh-oh, halfback. I like that. I don't like that. Shit, thought we could have had that. I don't know who just got torched, but somebody just got torched. It was 47. Don't tell me that was Jason Henderson. Well, this score is good for the over, and maybe we go to Mark Andrews right out the gates and go play action, see if he bites. Blitzing safeties, and you rushed three. I blocked six. How on earth did you walk through untouched? Second and 20, I'm gonna block Ali Gordon here. We gotta get some serious yards on this play. Okay, there's Mark Andrews. Yup, Marky Mark! Mark and Mark Andrews! He's hauling! Yes, sir! That's a, that's a giant pickoff off of a drag. He's also a really good deep threat option. First and 10. Oh, I definitely had somebody there. I'm gonna get inside of this for sure. Downfield blocks from 39. That's Kenny Vega throwing the downfield block. I'm gonna go corner route on Mark Andrews. Send Ollie Gordon in the middle for the user, and hopefully they'll kind of vacate. Wait, what? That coverage was so weird. Mariota! <laughs> I honestly probably had a touchdown there, but I think that was the safest route. I didn't want to throw something haywire and accidentally miss throw it. Second and five, revamped O-line. There's Ali Gordon. Getting vertical, getting thin. I love that touchdown. And you know I'm a go for two merchant. Hey, it's looking, it's looking good for the over. Two point conversion. He's got a QB spy on me. Oh, Mark. Mark Andrews. Dude, is a menace. Let's go. Eight to seven. Mark Andrews is the right call, I think. Okay, no, no, no. So let's try a different kick. Okay, I've seen this before. You go squib, you go down the middle, you go with like that much power. Is that right? I don't think I did it perfectly. But frankly, you can't return this, I don't think. That I, I think the squib down the middle is gonna be our, our move. It's gotta be, right? Toss left to Singleton. I've got a lot of bodies for this. Good defense. Tell you what, dude, College Football 25 is all about offense. Uh, does he cut this up? He does? Great tackle. Dude, this is Maryland strong safety trader junior. I really like him. I'm gonna get on Oladipo here. I'm on Vic Oladipo for the user. Oh, he's gonna have this right side. Oh my God. Oh my God, what a play. I nothing to say about that. That was, I did not see that open at all. Two point conversion, he needs it. Does he just hand this off? Play action. Oh, inner, wait, Oladipo. Victor Oladipo. <laughs> 13 8. I really am a go for two merchant, but it's worked against everybody so far. Oh, deep comeback. Get out the fucking. You caught that. He straight up robbed those yards from Kenny Vega. That is, oh my God. Hater mode activated, dude. He does not want Kenny Vega getting reps at all. Ooh, try to go Mark Andrews. Second and 10, we're going inside zone to Ali. Cut this up past the user, spin around the big hit. Can't go a game without speed option, you know? Third and five, can't keep that one. Ali, 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 no, Ali. That's crazy. Okay, so Mark Andrews is wide open. I'm gonna send him up the, oh, that's not Mark Andrews. It's Gervais. Gervais Johnson wants his spot back. Oh! Let's hit him with a little wildcat here. Ollie Gordon in the backfield, left side run. Uh-oh. Good spin. All right, this wildcat pass does not go to Mark Andrews, but Mark Andrews actually has a leak out option on this, so it technically does. 
<laughs> I technically could have thrown Mark Andrews. I just don't know what kind of throw we're going to get from Ollie Gordon. This is a wildcat just straight up the middle. Classic football. I, I think it's about time we got Ollie Gordon out of there, though. Ollie Gordon is hurting. This wildcat jet sweep goes to Nate Carter. That's no bueno. Because Nate Carter... I just got to cut this up. Nate Carter's a silver with 65 speed. We're just going stick here. Third and goal. That is just too easy. Revamped offensive line is holding really, really well. The go for two merchant is back in his bag. I'm gonna go fake toss. <laughs> Woo! That gives us a three point lead. Play action pass. I'm getting on Erlacher. First and 10, 50, 50 seconds left. We really do not want him to score before half. He's got the low one. Yeah, I kind of figured. Damn. 16 to 13. We got to stop him. It's going to be too much of a... Dude. What on earth is that blown cut? What? We're going to cover three. I should have a deep safety and a deep corner. Damn. That's the second time he's kind of torched me on one of those deep ones. I don't know what happened there, but... It's honestly good news. I know this sounds weird, but him scoring there means I'm going to get the possession before half. He realistically should have downed that at the one and then just kind of ran in. Okay. So his squib kick is just fucking broken. What on earth is that? Oh my God, that's like a... What are we doing, EA? What are we doing? You, you about just gave me a safety. Oh my God, I'm starting at the six. Kenny Vega being in that spot is so bad. Oh shit. Oh, he blitzed that corner. Okay, at least we have room to work now. Now I'm not as worried. Okay, we got time. Stand and fucking deliver, Mariota. Isaiah Nayor, out of bounds, hold your timeouts. Let's go. I set the feet, can't throw the bad ball. I love it. I love it. Okay, I'm gonna give Mark Andrews a manual corner route. This is Madden 20 all over again, baby. See how this looks. Oh, he's there. Oh my God, beautiful ball, Mariota. It's Mariota, not Mariota. I do that sometimes, sorry. Come on, let's execute though. This ain't over, let's execute. First and 10. Ollie's there. It's a little ugly, got to use a timeout, but it's eight yards. Motion Ollie Gordon out. Step up in the pocket, but stay. Stay and hit Ollie Gordon! What a fucking... No! Dog, you are so bailed. That is crazy. You just got a fumble on the actual one yard line. Ollie's not even fatigued. He's going for the same seam beater right here. And you caught that? Get the fuck out of here. What are we doing? How many fumbles have we had this season? Six? And they're, cr they're huge fumbles. I mean, game-determining fumbles. Not quite yet. Oh, my fucking God. This is such horse shit. I'm getting fucking cheesed. I'm getting cheesed to death. First and ten, he wants the safety again. I'm running the football. I'm gonna go Wildcat zone here. I feel like these are my best odds to just not get a safety. Ollie Gordon is going to make something out of nothing. That was pretty bagged up. Third and five here. At least we've got room so that it's not a safety. I cannot get tilted. Beautiful. Third and five. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Hatback base to Ollie Gordon. We got a pull blocker. Ooh! Monster run! I'm going to put Ollie on just an underneath, and I'm going to send Mark and Nayor. Hopefully the user kind of follows Nayor here. Lots of time. Money. Oh my God, the playmakers are gross right now. One, two. Come on! Let's go, Ali! Take the lead. I'm gonna take a field goal lead here. First time actually kicking the PAT. Hey, tell you what, over under 55? We're sitting at 43 right now, so that's good. We have the same amount of touchdowns. Keep that in mind. We have the same amount of touchdowns right now. I don't know how to do his glitch squib, so I'm just gonna kick this deep and we've got to cover. Beautiful. First and 10. Play action. He wants to come back to this. Oh, I knew it, but I'm too late. We're both nine for 10. He's got 198, I've got 266. I, I'm tempted to send a blitz, but I don't feel good about it enough yet. Damn, he just keeps feeding him. I have to get a possession back. I gotta get that fumble back, dude. Same play action play, no. Oh, I'm way too close to that to not get it. Come on, boys. We got to hold him down here. I really don't think he runs it. No. I'm on the silver. 
Whoo! He's literally throwing a lineman and they're they're mossing me. Those are actual tackles subbed in at tight end and they're mossing me. Second and goal could definitely be a run here. He really does run. Oh my god! Good defense! I thought it was a pick. It's just behind. Third and goal. Just behind that. Oh, it's play action. Okay, that's fine, because we're all over it. Trader Jr. Dante Trader Jr., the Maryland strong safety, is going to force a fourth and goal. I don't know. Does he kick this? I wouldn't kick this. He's going for it. I'm on Trader, but Erlacher's on that. Brian Erlacher. We got the ball back. That's our turnover back. We're even on turnovers now. We got a three-point lead. We got to march down this field and put in a touchdown. Over betters, I'm very sorry. That includes me. Ali Gordon for five. Dude, you know what I need? I need to get a backup halfback. Ali Gordon is putting in so many reps, so many good reps. But dude, he fought, you know, he fumbled. Okay, this looks like man coverage. How you stop Mark Andrews on this? Beyond me. That's how you stop Mark Andrews. A horrendous ball, uncatchable. That's how you stop. He was planted feet, that was blue. Mariota. I just got to take this with Mariota. Just reset the chains. We're going to chew clock, bring this clock down. I, I am a little bummed about my challenge wheel, but you got to play this smart. Two minutes left. He's got three timeouts, a few first downs. Follow your blocks. Follow your blocks. Okay. Let's look at our players. Okay, the only fatigued player on this lineup is my right guard. I don't know why he's so tired. This inside zone is so free. He just pulled his safeties off. This is a first down. What is the flag? Why did we just get a flag? Did we just get a false start? Second and nine. I got to go with the same play. Oh, I need him to get out there sooner. We're almost out of this game, boys. Oh my God, they get insane pass rush and I get blown up. Fourth and six, I'm going for it. He's gonna chew out the clock and beat me on, a, on the last play. I can't let that happen. We gotta pick this up right here, right now. Let's get a decoy. Send Isaiah Naor to the left side as a decoy route. We've got Mark Andrews and Gordon. Mariota. The gates open. Oh my God, great blocking, boys. We never needed it so bad. Did just make a huge mistake by not sliding and going out of bounds. But we can change the ball carrier to conservative. That was a risky ass fourth down. Ball carrier is conservative. Ali should not fumble. I think it's still possible. It's really hard to fumble when you're on conservative. I'm gonna take the edge, cut this up. He's not gonna call a timeout, which is gonna end this ball game for the like almost. Ball game. Woo! That was scary. That was scary, boys. But we hang on. We hang on. He didn't score. Shut him out in the second half. We got seven in the third quarter and our two two point conversions. That's actually what we won the game off of. We both had three touchdowns. And Mariota with back to back players of the game last week and this week. That play was nasty. The double spin tutty for Ollie Gordon. Dude, he was beaming me with some deep passes, though. That, what's that kick? How do I stop that kick from like ruining my life? I almost got a safety twice. Started every drive on the four. Once again, I really do think we made the right choice. So nine for 12 and a touchdown for Mariota. Rushing, 13. Team for 96, a touchdown and a big fumble for Ali Gordon. That fumble was brutal. And then receiving our number one receiver, Ali Gordon, three for 80, but truly our number one receiver, Mark Andrews, two for 89. We hit Nayor, two for 46, and never found Travis Hunter. Nice work, though, boys. Really nice work. We were playmakering and scrambling the best that we have all season long. So I'm really excited about that. Now, unfortunately, we did not complete our challenge. I bet on the over 55. We ended with a really low scoring second half, landing us at 43 total points. So no challenge wheel for us, but we keep Mark Andrews, we keep Jeremy James, we keep Jason Henderson, and we keep Teron Tayo. Huge win today, boys. I'm geeked up about that. And I'll see you boys in the next episode. Peace.